1980 was my second Olympia. So I was just starting to get my feet wet. Arnold, I saw him every day in the gym. He looked better and better and better. So I started wondering, oh, what's, something's out here. Here's Tom Platz's perspective on the 1980 Olympia. He's not getting in that kind of shape just for a movie. There's something going on here. So I knew there was something. And then when he showed up on the plane, too, I'm like, ah. Uh -huh. May he rest in peace. Mike was a great guy. Mike Menser, he would say, Tom, here before the 81 Olympia, here's the keys to my condo in Palm Springs. Go get some sun, whatever you need, man. You know, Mike was especially helpful. But I think what Mike carried was the bitterness of losing to Arnold. To him, it was not subjective. You know, and it was supposed to be accurate and objective. And it's like Muhammad Ali coming back. You know, like, uh, they're going to give him, they're going to throw it his way, probably. And so I sort of suspected they would do that to Arnold. Arnold was good in a few shots. You know, that mantis pose, and like double bicep. He was good. Sometimes you win when you're not supposed to, sometimes you don't win when you're supposed to, and that's the way I sort of looked at it.